Assalamu alaikum anatomy and clinical anatomy of the costal group. This is the posterior end, this is anterior end and this is the shaft of the typical rib. This is the internal surface of the rib. There is a ridge present in the internal surface and this is lower border. So, costal group is situated in between the ridge and inferior border. It is a depressed area contained from above downward intercostal vein, artery and nerve. So, lower border is related with intercostal nerve. Coastal group can be divided into lower part and upper part. From the least or upper part, the innermost intercostal muscle is attached and in the lower part, the internal intercostal muscle is attached. This is the lower border of upper rib. This is the upper border of lower rib. The upper border of the lower rib can be divided into a outer part and inner part. This is the external intercostal muscle. It attaches to the lower border of upper rib and outer part of the upper border of lower rib. From the coastal group, the internal intercostal muscle is attached and reach the innermost intercostal muscle is at us. This two muscle is at us the inner part of the upper border of lower rib and the intercostal vein artery nerve is situated in between intercostal muscle and innermost intercostal muscle and for avoiding the injury to the intercostal nerve always enter the needle upper border of lower rib. Never enter the needle through the lower border of upper rib and you should always identify the intercostal space other way otherwise the needle hit the bones. So, this is all about clinical anatomy of the intercostal group.